Have you ever been to a conference where you want to capture the information from the PowerPoint the speaker is talking about? Have you ever been to a meeting where you want to take a picture of the whiteboard with the awesome roadmap or the awesome drawing that you have written down? Have you ever been in a situation where you want to take a picture of a business card or a napkin deal in a good way? Well, there turns out there's an app for that called Office Lens. And Office Lens has the ability to store in your collection section within OneNote. It even supports OneDrive for business and two-factor authentication. Here's how you set it up on an Android phone. So first you install Office Lens on your Android phone. You open Office Lens and for the first time you need to just, uh, you get the picture. You go to the menu and you need to add an account and you sign in using the account where you stored your OneNote workbook. We created this workbook in my first um, OneNote lifehack video where for Windows machines. So check out that video if you haven't seen it. After you have logged on to OneDrive, you go back and take that first picture. When you have taken that picture, you get the option to save. I like to save it to OneNote as well as, uh, as a picture on my phone. You can choose either. But the first time you go and click on default section, and then you browse to your collection section and choose that. From now on, the collection section will be the default section. Now you can store it. I want to show you another example where I take a picture from a whiteboard and notice how Office Lens really formats the picture in a good way. So even if you have a bad angle, it will straighten that up and make it more readable. It's really great and the best way to take notes during a conference, during workshops and so on. So now you see that the collection section is the default section and you click save and it get published to the collection section. So you know where to find it the next time. I have been into too many meetings where I tried to take picture of the whiteboard, never to find it again. So this is a life hack for saving information that you find on the go, just like saving that business card as well before you lose it. So when you open OneNote again, you see how it's formatted and you can take additional notes to that picture as well. So this was how to take notes and take pictures in a good way in a conference, workshop, taking picture of that business card. Hope it was useful for you and help you succeed with my OneNote productivity system. Please make sure to subscribe to my channel to get notifications when I post new OneNote life hacks.